G'day everyone, Matt Elder here, and today we're going to look at how Lego bricks are made. We recently went on the Lego factory tour at Legoland Dubai. You start off in an area which gives you highlights from Lego's history since 1932. The tour commences with an introduction from your tour guide, and of course is watched over by Lego minifigs. You are taken into a small theatre and shown a short overview film on how Lego bricks are made. At the end of the film, everyone moves on to the main factory floor, which, as all things Lego, is in bright saturated colours, with more Lego minifigures hard at work. All bricks start out life as a plastic granulate. Here it's yellow, as today we're making yellow bricks. From here it's fed into the plastic injection moulding machine. The plastic granulate is forced along a screw and heated between 230 and 260 degrees, becoming a toothpaste-like consistency. This is then forced into the mould, and takes the shape of the desired plastic brick. It is then cooled and popped out of the mould. This all takes about 10 seconds. That means almost 2 million bricks an hour, or 15 billion bricks a year. Bricks are transported along the conveyor belt, up and over. Here you can see the blank 2x4x3 yellow brick, which travels further up and over into the printing area. Printing is your standard four color offset process. This uses the colored inks of cyan, magenta, yellow, and black. From these four colours, all other colours can be made and printed. This is used in all printing such as books, magazines, newspapers, comics, billboards, etc. It's like those rubber stamp and ink pads you have as a kid. You take your rubber stamp and place it in your ink pad and load it up with ink. And then you stamp it on the paper, or in this case a Lego brick. You do this four times, one for each colour of cyan, magenta, yellow and black. After this, the brick is placed under some heat to help the ink dry faster. And here is the printed brick after this process. Bricks then travel along up and over into the packaging area. Bricks are then dropped into this vibrating bowl, which is then used so they can be separated into individual bricks, with the conveyor belt taking them to the packaging machine. Here the individual brick drops into an open plastic bag and is then sealed. This individually sealed plastic brick travels along the conveyor belt and into a box for further packaging and distribution. Here is our finished sealed 2x4x3 brick from the Lego factory in Legoland, Dubai. By just changing the graphic print on the brick, this can create a variety of different bricks. Thanks for watching the video, and here are a selection of other videos you might be interested in. Please share, like, and subscribe, as it really helps us out and being able to create more videos for you. Happy building, until next time when we talk about all things Lego.